Controversy continues this weekend with Safe Park. It's the group of homeless people living in dream pods in downtown's Viente del Gosto Park. Now there's a health concern. The county says the sidewalks are dirty. They're supposed to be power washed on Friday and Saturday nights, but that didn't happen this weekend. Nine Inch Sides' Keaton Thomas explains why. This is the notice set up outside Vente de Agosto Park downtown. It says Friday and Saturday nights, the downtown Tucson partnership is supposed to power wash the sidewalks around the park. Friday, the, um, the downtown Tucson partnership did show up punctually, uh, ready to pressure wash the sidewalk. But uh, according to the new governmental order, they aren't to um, do any maintenance here without a police escort. The partnership contracts with the city to clean up all of downtown, but for this specific area, they say they will only do so with a police escort. John McLean says the past two nights, Tucson police were not there. Council member Steve Kozachik says Tucson police were probably doing something more important. It's a waste of police resources. They have other more important things to do than watch the partnership power wash a sidewalk. His point being there should not be a situation where police are needed there. But John McLean says those living in the park are not a safety concern. The only, only uh, reason I've heard is there's, I guess, one incident where somebody, and it wasn't even a member of, uh, of the, the camp here, um, poked one of the downtown Tucson partnership maintenance guys around here. Kazachik says it's more than that. They're being aggressively panhandled, they're being spit at, they're being cursed at. Uh, frankly, it's not just the partnerships people, it's people who live down there, it's pedestrians who are walking down there. It was gem show patron. As of now, the sidewalks remain unwashed, the trash cans full, and police will need to escort cleaning crews from the partnership. Keaton Thomas, Kagan 9 on your side.